Hello, Buckeyes. I'm Christina Johnson, president of The Ohio State University, with another health, safety, and well-being update. Please check out our Community Crime Map, a newly launched tool that enhances our comprehensive approach to communicating about safety. The map helps you quickly view crimes occurring off campus in a visual format and set up your own email alerts that can be sent daily, weekly, or monthly. I encourage you to visit our Department of Public Safety website for a step-by-step -step video on how to customize the map to meet your needs. On campus, we've completed installation of cameras in the Ohio Union garages, as well as four license plate readers in areas nearby. We also have plans to add cameras in garages serving our Wexner Medical Center in addition to other locations around campus. Fostering dialogue and engagement among our community and those charged with helping to keep us safe is a vital element in Ohio State's collaborative approach to safety. Next Friday, April 8th, our Office of Student Life will host the conclusion of this year's food truck event series. The event will be from 4 to 6 p.m. in the University District. Come out and join our community ambassadors for free food and good conversation. If you have a few extra minutes, I encourage you to learn more about faculty member Simone Drake, who's leading an interdisciplinary project aimed at improving relations between police and the communities they serve. Her work is bringing together police officers and community members of different races, legal experts, and computer engineers who can create models of human behavior scenarios to assist in training. It's the kind of convergent research on issues of great societal importance that defines our university's academic and service missions. Finally, this is the last week to register for our Buckeye Booster Drawing. Remember to sign up by Sunday, April 3rd to be eligible to win a $100 gift card. After next week, 800 students and faculty and staff who receive their COVID-19 booster will have won gift cards. Thank you to all who participated and especially for helping to keep yourself and one another safe. I'll have more updates next week, but in the meantime, go Buckeyes!